Yeah, I've said it before in one of my videos that UK no be for lazy people. UK is not for a lazy man. You understand? Regardless of whatever you might be in Nigeria or whatever you might be in any of the African countries you are coming from, coming into the UK is a total different ball game entirely. A totally different thing entirely. You understand? Regardless of who you might be, when you get to the UK, you got to do the job that is available to you. You understand? Though you might not like the job, you understand? But you just have to do it to keep body and souls together, to be able to put food on the table, to be able to pay the rent and pay the bills. That's the reason why you are finding yourself in some areas. And I have said it, I remember I made mention of it in that video that a lot of people that were where to do, maybe bank manager, assistant bank manager, teachers, you know, uh, ministry workers back in Nigeria then, upon arrival in the UK, you see them in different kinds of sectors, working as security, working as, you know, not... Security is a good job as well, you know, if you know your way around it, you understand. Now, the one of the guys I that I just finished speaking to, I spoke to him about an hour ago now. I said to him, can you work as a kitchen porter? Because this guy has been, you know, sending me different kinds of messages. I've been in the UK for over nine months. I have not been working. Can you help me? Can you assist me? So I was able to see if it's possible for me to actually, because the guy has been sending me messages over some time now. And I said, okay, let me just try my best to see what how I can help this guy, you know. And I said to him, can you work as a kitchen porter? To those of you that are not aware of what kitchen porter is, kitchen porter is when you help them to wash plates and pots and spoons, cutleries and things like that in the kitchen of a restaurant or an hotel. You understand? Things like that. Generally washing in the kitchen. You understand? Oh, he said, I can't. He said, no, 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 I can't do that kind of job. You know, I was a level six, level seven in the ministry of, uh, I can't remember whether ministry of education or ministry of information. He made mention of it. You know, oh, I'm looking for a befitting job. No, no, not befitting. Uh, at least something that is a little bit up there. So I said, listen, you just have to keep doing this job until you are able to find something. You see, this is the this is the situation. We have a lot of people, a lot of people in this country that were one time, you know, bank managers, senior police officers back in Nigeria. And coming to the UK, they are working in various sectors that are that is not even of, of their choice. You know? But at least because they have the gumption that at least at some point in the future, they can change. At some point in the future, they will eventually get something that they want, something that they desire. You understand? You know, when you come to my DM to tell me, oh, I've been in the UK for 10 months. I've been in the UK for 10, one year. Uh, I'm, I'm unable to find job. That's not the reason why you have not been able to find a job because you are looking for that particular job you desire. It is not it is not going to be possible for you to just get to the UK and get the job that you desire just immediately. You understand? You just have to keep doing it. A lot of people are working in care homes. A lot of people are working in the security sectors. A lot of people are working as, uh, as, uh, as, uh, as, um, as what's it called? They are working as cleaners and things like that. It doesn't mean these jobs are not good. These jobs are also paying something. They are paying you money to be able to pay your bills. They are paying money to be able to feed yourselves. It's a different ball game entirely, but people are finding it very difficult to understand. You understand? So a lot of people were even saying, oh, it's difficult. I feel like going back. If you want to go back, go back. That's just the thing. If you want to go back, go back. If you don't want to go back, if you have it at the back of your mind that at, the, at some point in the future, it's going to be okay for me. I've said it in one of my videos that I've done a couple of months ago. I said, UK is a process. You are passing through a process. You understand? There is a time to be hungry. There is a time to be full. You understand? There is a time to be in lack. There is a time to be in abundance. That is the way the system is working. You understand? Because you are coming from totally a different continent, a different country into here you understand so you have to understand the fact that any job that is available to you you just have to start doing it except if you're a lazy man and uk is not for a lazy man have it at the back of your mind so if you are coming to the uk you need to understand the fact that anything that is available to you you have to do a lot of security officers are doing tremendously well a lot of cleaners are doing well a lot of uh, people working in the care home are doing well you understand so don't underrate those jobs Kitchen porters, people working in the restaurant, uh, waiters, waitresses, and, you know, people, they are doing really well. I don't understand the reason why you are coming from Nigeria because you are you were level six or level seven. You understand? You understand what I'm trying to say? And you get, you got to the UK, you are seeing this particular job as not up to your standard. A job that could fetch you about £1,800 every month is not up to your standard. So I don't know what kind of job you want to start doing. You get what I'm trying to say? So you need to understand that fact that if you are coming, you know, to the UK, you need to have it at the back of your mind that you will do some jobs that is not your desired job. You just have to manage it. You just have to continue to do it and put your eyes to the ground until you are able to get something that you desire. This is really, really important. So if you are coming in my DM, any job that I think is available that I will help you to search for, 
If I tell you, if you say you're not going to do it, I'll just put you on the side and go to the next person. So these are the kind of jobs that you can easily get. If you're not an accountant, you can't just begin to work in an accounting firm. If you're not a lawyer, you can't continue to work in a law firm. You understand? So there are some jobs that don't require so much from you that you can just begin to do just for the very few months that you arrive on in UK. So long you are legally res resident in the UK. You understand? There are jobs that are currently available for you to do. Such jobs I've mentioned. Don't underestimate these jobs. They are paying well as well. If you know exactly how to go about these things. Don't underestimate these jobs. 